It's my hope, anyway. Right. As a chair once said, I can dream, Harold. I like that there's, a, there's like a queue there, but like there's no other person to deal with the queue. What do you mean invalid navigation? What are you talking about? God damn it. We did it, boys. Meteor shower? I sure hope it does. Wait. Why is it? Whenever you clip your nails in front of a computer, one of the nails they didn't die. flies into the cracks of your keyboard. Great news. Keyboard feed on them? I don't know. No one knows. Don't like this. If it could cease and or desist, that would be fantastic. Fan dabby dozy. God, give me a decent goddamn doctor. The people are having to queue like mad here. Right, let's give him stuff to do. Yeah, right. <laughs> Start sending everybody home. We got the extra objective done. I'll rip that person. Oh, finally, a doctor that might actually be a GP. When I grow up, working the deluxe and I'm not going to disturb you right now. If we can get like one more. I, <laughs> the greed. If we can get one more that would be duper super. Just so we have two like actual GP doctors. Mm, big stretch. Oh boy. They're actually having to wait as well. Ooh, you hate to see it. You know what? Why are you wandering off? I literally just gave you a job. Yeah, I'm gonna need to, uh... Get DNA room pretty quickly to justify the, the reasoning for that person. Or I could just make another GP room. Thirsty? Mate, there's, a, there's drinks available. I would notice a lot of these people that are upset about various aspects of my hospital are like ignoring the fact that they could solve their issues. Ba, 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 da, da. Ba, ba, da, ba, da, ba, da. Oh, come on. Give me a give me a blank dog to play with. Phrasing? <sighs> Franklin, you're too powerful, my friend. Right, so you are GP only. I think <sighs> I feel like we only need we need uh I dunno. I'm just trying to think carefully here because I don't want to put people in crappy positions. I just want two GP doctors and then my brain can kind of like start sorting things out a little bit. <laughs> Jake Fwockhammer. Absolute Fwocker. 
How many patients we got left? Five? What are they doing? Where is she? Most of them seem to be ward, to be fair. Oh, I know what I need to do. I always forget to do this. Never mind, they've already got it up. Ignore me. Usually that fast strike thing is an issue, but today it appears not. We don't need to upgrade the easy scan, it's fine. Don't think we're gonna get that staff request done. Not unless someone's prepared to pay 40k for like very basic treatment. We never know. Incredibly unlikely, but you never know. Raccoons? Yo! That little fella fell straight in the bin. Poor lad. Did he just sweep up the raccoon that was in the bin? I'm confused. My uh, peach, my uh, hoo, my uh, ha, my uh, ha, ha. Uh, I'm very tempted to grab the surgeon as well. Anytime there's someone who's like a specialist. Why aren't you in line? Really? Ooh, that's irritating. Get pop that one there. Okay, who's, there's one patient left. Who is it? Where are they? Where is she? Well, now would be a good time to get some training done. Let's go see what the uh, next doctor looks like. But I know they need training. Stop yelling at me. Right, so... We are not going to have time to get that done because the next wave's coming. In fact, we'll wait till the next wave before we start messing around with stuff again. Unblock free toilets. What a weird objective. People barely use the toilets because of the spongy cake balls. <laughs> Right, see, we're gonna need a clown clinic. So I am gonna get ahead of that and get that built now. Two point radio. Vasa Stas, streamer paying attention. Congratulations for joining me on this, the finest day of the year, the day of my birth. Needless to say, today's show will honor the man of the hour, the heartbeat of this county, and the crown jewel of Two Point Radio. Me, Yikes. Sir Nigel Bickle. I'm glad we don't have to deal with aliens again on this one. I did wonder if that was going to be like a consistent mechanic in the game. Luckily, it looks like no. So I think I'd be throwing stuff if that was the case. Do with someone coming to take a dump. Do you fancy uh, unblocking toilets? Nurse required in clown clinic. I always forget to dress up my, uh, my little dudes. Come on, someone take a poop. I want none of you poop. Someone's got to want to use the toilet. I think if we get rid of the spongy cake balls and then go with like the standard food, it'll stop being so absorbent. Yeah! I think someone's in there. Quick, unblock it! There's only four patients remaining. Please, somebody? You, sir, madam? I, I literally just asked someone to unblock a toilet. Why aren't you going to do that? Because the guy that's all the way over there is doing it. Why? God, this 
game's ridiculous sometimes. <laughs> ah, there's a person right next to, uh... Hey, Dean, welcome back. There's a person right next to the toilet. They could go unblock the toilet, but instead... We'll ask someone else to do it. Yeah, I know I need to unblock... Didn't I not just unblock another toilet? Hello? Game? If the game's gonna screw me, I'm gonna be really pissed off. Come on. There we go. God, this game sometimes, dude. How was your walk, Dean? Did you go anywhere exciting? Did you see any cats? That's how I judge how good a walk's been at this stage. And I saw a cat. Good thing about being a healthcare worker at the moment is the amount of free stuff we're getting. Yeah, I can imagine. Absolutely rolling in it, aren't you, mate? How many free pizzas have you had? Ugh. I know I said I was going to do some training in the in the middle of the, all that, but... I don't really have an option. Train four staff. Fuck me. I'm about to train one person. I can probably train like three staff if I'm quick. 40 patients as well, I might be okay. I cannot help but think back to those birthdays of yesteryear and the sepia what do you days do? of my youth. Are you the undercover reporter? Right. Opened hoop and stick. My sister Looking at my what are you doing? Favorite marble, rough housing in the parlor, the air thick with the smell of my ma's spotted A lot of pharmacy people. Uh, those are some of my favorites. I mean, if I need to train three, I can just grab those assistants Which of my and train them in something. Favorite? Uh, see Pan's lab there, so I think we'll get ahead on that one as well. 4x4 four four for the Pan's lab. Unsurprising. What do you mean, dink? I know our money's low, it's okay. Trust me. Free lunch, free Easter eggs, free energy drinks, including Monster every day. Dude! It's trying to make me jealous. <laughs> That's just mean. No, you, you deserve it, dude. You absolutely deserve it. You and everybody else is currently working in healthcare. I know that sounded vaguely... <laughs> <laughs> Vaguely sarcastic. It doesn't out. It isn't at all. I genuinely mean it. God, it's, it's an awful time of year to be uh, sarcastic, isn't it? End of year approaching. My money. Bitch, better have my money. I should be able to train two more if we're lucky. God, we're gonna have to deal with we're dealing with the same shit as last time where it's kind of like money's gonna get really low at certain points but then it'll go up during the middle of waves it's all over to shop we're just standing around what are you waiting for just sit this bench is provided have a seat Honestly, I haven't really contributed, but it's nice to see people finally appreciating all the stuff within the NHS. Yeah, always takes a bloody emergency to uh, fully appreciate people, isn't, doesn't it, really? I know there's a queue. What do you want me to do? In fact, what I should do is make sure the new staff are going to the right place.
Right, uh, do we have two people available for treatment? One, we do, perfect. So, you and you and you. Trained by you. And that'll be the training the thing sorted. Wonderbar. Yeah, so, talking about the NHS thing, it's something I've, like, been seeing on my walks as well. And, like, a lot of houses with, like, the rainbows and stuff like that, and thank you, NHS. There's just been, like, one or two extra ones every time I've, like, walked through it. It's been really nice to see. Like I said, it's, it's, it's good that people are finally appreciating the NHS a lot more now. I know these people need training. Yeah, actually, we could do another treatment, Doctor. And I see, yeah, I just hope people don't forget after this is all over. As I mentioned to my dad the other day, I always find it amusing when somebody says, when it's all over. Because I cannot see that being a thing for a very, very long time. Somebody actually pointed out the other day, it's like, we already have, like, three other regular coronaviruses, one of which causes the common cold, and we don't have vaccines for them. So, how likely is it that we actually get a true uh, vaccine for COVID-19? Realistically, will we? Again, not a healthcare expert, never claimed to be, don't want to be, but, you know, I think people are kind of holding on to hope for something that might not necessarily be a thing that can be done. But at the same time, we can't live like this forever, so it's a difficult one. It's crazy to me that, like, as much as I support Labour, Labour are going off on, uh, uh, the government and going, oh, yeah, whatever, it's all great and stuff, but, like, we, when, are you, when are you going to start talking about plans to get away from this and all that? And I'm like, well, I don't think they will, because there's not going to be, I don't see an end to this lockdown for a good month or two yet, because you can guarantee you, as soon as this lockdown's over, everybody's going to be back to being just morons again. Like, people, there's still, you know, a minority, granted, but there's still people now that aren't following guidelines. If the lockdown gets relaxed and they say, oh yeah, we, you just need to do this, I can see it just cropping back up again. But I suppose we've got Italy to look at soon, because they're lifting their restrictions. Germany's lifting some of theirs. Wuhan's out as well, apparently, but to be honest, I'm not living any different from how I usually do. I am, but only in the aspect that I'm not going out for food. It's literally it. And I'm, I'm cooking a lot more in the way of breakfast and stuff like that. Other than that, it's not really any different for me. Yeah, don't be lifting it too early. I mean, it's the same logic of when to put it in as well. Like, I think now, with hindsight, with it being 2020, I almost don't think there was a situation where it was ever too early <laughs> to put a lockdown in. But like, there's definitely a situation where if you lift it too early, you're going to have a second peak. But again, we've got other countries we can start looking at now. I think Germany is probably like the main one to look at, but they had a pretty good handle on it anyway, so I don't know, it's a difficult one. Again, not an expert. I just sound very intelligent. <laughs> well, he sounds like he knows what he's talking about, but... Uh, right, what is our staff situation right now? You're such a difficult person to pin down. 
problem is we don't have an x-ray so we might as well keep you as gp Habit of valorizing anyone who uses a German efficiency. Their primary well, supposedly they were just like um, going nuts on testing people, weren't they? Like super early. Into what is, by and large, I do wonder if they've just had as many deaths as everybody else. They've just tested more people. If, you, if that makes sense. Like if they hadn't tested that many people, that many people still would have died. I don't know. It, it's a weird one. They just know of more people that have have the virus more than anything. I suppose it's the situation. But, I don't know. It looks good for them, so... Best course of action is testing as many as possible. No, you're not wrong. At the absolute minimum with testing more people, you're going to end up with more information on how to deal with this stuff. Right. Wait, how are we already like 30 days into the ward patients? Generate research points? Shit. Oh, that's a fucking pain in the dick. I really didn't want to do research. Who's that stupid loser that's still hanging around? I'm afraid that they've lost me. Cause all the time they fight, there's only one thing to say. It's that you've got a nice smelling face. Uh, let's just go general. Alright, let's see if there's any new diseases that we're going to have to take care of. Because we're running out of room. Is the other issue. Nothing obvious. Beautiful. Oh, we're generating points pretty quickly, so it's not too bad. I love the fact the assistants like to go on break as soon as a wave starts. Ridiculous. Damn pain in the asses. Nice Murdo. Beautiful. He's actually paying attention. Makes change. Honestly, I might just have put another doctors in. Psychiatry, ah. That presents an issue. Yo, it's a psychiatry doctor, perfect. I've got no room for psychiatry, shit. Flemington's premier vendor of candles and East Asian culinary equipment. Light, true, burn, persistent. Aroma, not unfragrant. All in all, an admirable effort. It all started when I was a young lad. When I was a young boy, my father took me into the city to see a marching band. Imagine going to a psychiatrist's office and that was your report. It all started when I was a young boy. Right, you are going to be psychiatry only. You'd love to see it. That's the second time that's happened where it's been like, ah, oh, shit, I need a specific kind of doctor. And they've been there, luckily. All right, your diagnosis. Your di uh, yeah, okay, we, we, we should be good on all these rooms. What's he got? One that's treatment only as well for now. Okay, 200 research points already generated. 
a list of things you'd love to see over here, and that is absolutely on it. I do want to move that uh, research room. How much was the... So that's 65,000. It's only 20k for that one. Oh, ah, okay. I might grab that and make it an admin room. Just put the training and the uh, research in there. Right now we just need to save money. Where is my pharmacist nurse? Where is she? Oh, wait, no, it's a diagnosis nurse. One's in cardiology. I'm confused. Sure, uh, homesick? Oh. What does homesick look like? Are you homesick? Yeah, okay. Eleanor Squirm. What a name. Beautiful British name. Uh, okay, we've got a surgeon in the background somewhere. Mark Digestive. Don't dunk him, he'll crumble. Are your salt levels dangerously low? <laughs> oh, it's bloody game. Are your sock levels dangerously low? Right in your mouth. 24 hours a day. I'm having salt levels. This is two, two point radio. But I still prefer the idea of someone being dangerously low on socks. Ten patients remain. The raccoon drops in this bin. I need a screenshot. Nope. Never mind. So a, a threat of raccoons and there was none. I'm upset. I wish to be set by little bandit po uh, Pokemon. Bandit boys. <laughs> Words are hard. Da -da -da. So, that, how much room have I got there? Is that a three by three? I think it is. I don't like this whole losing money thing. It's disgusting. So, I'm kind of just realizing it, my webcam's a bit in the way. It's a bit late to move it now, but at least it's moved for next time. There we go. I could probably just boot myself off the screen. It would probably solve the issue. Five patients. He's clearly a clown. Send him to the clown clinic. Why? Why? Why is there a? level of confusion there. Ah, he looks like a clown. Should we send him for treatment at the clown clinic? Nah, I'd be fine. Don't worry about it. Yo, they dead off. Ba -da -da. I really appreciate all the damage that's happening. I was doing things! I just want to change the ward, if I'm honest. Did you see the run? <laughs> I haven't seen anyone run for the toilet in god knows how long since I've had those spongy cake ball uh, vending machines. <laughs> they almost eliminate the need for a toilet, which is great. Toad Hall unlocked. Am I gonna start having to deal with people with some kind of toad thing? Cures patients with frogborn. Jesus Christ, really? I'm hoping I'm not pulling... Pulling that too early. A marketing campaign. God damn it. <laughs> On two point radio. I have a message from Jerry. Is it in free section? Oh Hello, god it is. Nigel. Happy birthday. My name is Jerry. I am five years old. How many years old are you? 
How dreadfully adorable. Hello, Jerry. This is going to be a temporary thing well until the admin room's in. Unfortunately, I don't answer such uncouth questions. Complete a marketing campaign. General marketing, go. You're Miktoff. You are now a marketeer. Good luck. Crack on. You've got three months. And you are locked in this room until the marketing is done. A lot of people for the jupe. The jupe. Waiting for that toad hall to pop up. I'm not seeing anyone who looks like a frog so far. Are they the ones wearing green? Can't really do that right now. Well, luckily, with these waves, it's a, it's less like most of the horde mode so far, because you're literally dealing with um, objectives within the waves, rather than having to get like a certain cure rate, so... I suppose you could literally get the thing done, then just like kick everybody out. I wouldn't recommend doing it that way, but, you know, some people might want to. I am looking at my current setup and I'm kind of like I'm probably gonna need some more diagnosis machines soon. Uh, we have no DNA labs. Okay, so Frogborn is the thing. Remember Warframe? I remember Warframe. It was alright. I enjoyed it. Seven by four. I can't even fit that into a conventional room. What a delight today's show has been. I can only hope that it pales in comparison to the real deal this what the next month. What the fuck is this? I'm hoping that you enjoyed today's trial run. Ta -ta. What a ridiculously sized room. That's fun as shit of a group of us. It was. I honestly wish I put more like time and effort into it. It's another one of those games that I spent, like, not loads of microtransactions, but, you know, enough. And we kind of, like, yeah, never played it again after, uh, after a while. It's started to become quite the hit list of games like that now. I started playing Dauntless not too long ago, and I think I spent, like, money on a battle pass, money on a couple of cosmetics, and then... Yeah, never went back to play it. Definitely going to want some more treatment nurses. I can't get it. Can't get what? What? Yo, <laughs> they were a frog. Did they just turn that person into a frog and killed them? He wasn't like that a minute ago. What just happened? This is absolutely a thumbnail opportunity. God, this game's so ridiculous. Yo, they have to slide. Are they supposed to be turned into a frog? <laughs> God, this game's so dumb. It's a games at the moment. I mean, I, I think I spoke about this on stream not too long ago. But 
I don't really play games outside of um, outside of streaming anymore. Like, I, I, it's not the straight tree. I play a lot of RuneScape, but like, how much of a game is that? <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, I don't really play games as much as I watch stuff these days. It's not that I don't find gaming fun or anything like that. It's just, you know. Not something I necessarily do anymore, much. For f I don't say I don't do it for fun, because obviously, you know, still enjoy video games. But yeah, I, I enjoy watching TV and stuff a lot more now. Probably do some... Ooh, uh... S new stuff that needs to be treatment only. Are we... Do we not have enough diagnosis nurses again? Might need to look at diagnosis nurses. Bum, bum, bum. On a break, work in general, on a break on call. Ricky Hawthorne. Ricky we grown-ups now? <laughs> no, it ain't that. <laughs> How dare you accuse me of being an adult? And remember, the honey I'm referring to here is my voice. There's no need to panic and call in to complain like last time. Bit creepy. Nah, it's... I, I don't know. I suppose... I don't want to say that games are more seen as a job for me, because that's not true at all. But it's more a case of if I'm playing a video game, I'm kind of like, this could be like really good content. And instead of doing said content, I'm kind of like wasting it by not doing it on stream kind of thing. It's also why I try to experiment a bit more as well. It's like, I have, uh, I've streamed a bit of RuneScape, and while it's not the most interesting thing to watch, I feel like I've done, like, two really good streams with Shiv. Just, like, chatting shit while playing the game. I don't know. It's, it's a bit of a weird one. Excuse me, that seems to be on fire. It is, uh, El Fuego. Why isn't my psychiatry person going over there? The you break. Dr. Max Dobson. And once that's done, we've got an admin building. On the upgrade for the toad hall. We'll start moving some treatment up there now as well. Definitely move marketing as well. Do, 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 do. Always nice to have like a couple of training rooms. So if we establish they are now moving up there, then that is lovely. Well, that's not quite worked out the way I wanted it to. Excellent. Exactly. Do. Right, wave eight starting now. Let's see how we go. Hospital attractiveness of sixty-five percent. Yeah. 
You bring out the yokes, boys. 65% attractiveness? Not a problem. We're almost there already. Well, would you believe it? A tree came crashing through my conservatory last night. Well, no sense dwelling on the past, and the place does look greener now. Here's a nice song to celebrate. Easy clap. Bring Attention. out the yokes. <laughs> I thought we can just like get rid of them straight after as well. Not that I want to get rid of Yucks, but they're a bit in the way. 910 dollars. It's a solid hospital budget. I do need to find time to train my ward nurses. They're kind of in a bit of a precarious position right now. Possibly might hire another GP as well. Chromotherapy? Send home. We can't really afford to get something like that right now. Apparently, we have no choice. Would an assistant please go to marketing? Oh, it wasn't that expensive, actually. Four by three room. So let's go pause it a second because otherwise it'll. Uh tick over and possibly remove my money. But you better have my money. Ba, 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 da, 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 da. Right, if this is becoming a bit of a treatment room, then maybe it's worth which we're gonna stuff room into. Ba, 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 ba. Dean, what do you need in a uh, NHS staff room? Is it just coffee and cake? Should be plenty, right? Coffee and cake? Uh, and a bin? Perfect. Problem solved. Okay, so that's a chromotherapy done as well, which has cost us a chunk, which is probably going to put us in the minus, but at least we can cure people. 10 out of 10 staff room. Good. All I need to know. <laughs> Right, uh, sponge your cake balls. Probability. Bin. We've received yet another prank phone call asking us to raise awareness of pilfering raccoons. But I won't be fooled. Although they may look like tiny thieves, this isn't some far-fetched cartoon. This is real life. I need to get a screenshot of the uh, raccoons in a bin. It's very cute. So if I am going the GP route, I think if we grab Miss Catherine Lane, and pause the game so she can't run off anywhere, she shouldn't be. And then make sure she can only go where we tell her to go. This isn't a weird power thing. I'm just trying to arrange my stuff. I see a cow. And then... Move that one, and that one over there. Can you get out of my face, Lila Force? Okay. 
There we go. Don't think we need another GP right now, but at least we've got the option. Ugh. Big stretch. I think we might want to look at another diagnosis room next. It's a bit far, so I might turn this one into diagnosis and then move treatment over to these two up here. The treatment in the middle sounds like a good idea. A solid it's a 5 out of 10 idea. Please don't die, I need the money. Now we just let the game play. Let it ride. Can I get in a cardiology there? I can, but there's only room for one by one. Irritating. Uh, what emergency? Yeah, send them. I think I might edit this. Yeah, I thought I'd like more people around. Excellent. I'm kind of a mind of like, I might end up moving it again, but we'll see. Okay, that was, that was quick. I might be able to get some rooms into the right there. Yo, that cow got abducted. Never mind. Might cause a bit of a cluster, but we'll see. Stop dying, frog boys and girls. No, they're all frog boys, actually. Um. Dude, that's a lot of frog boys dying. That's three dead frog boys. We do not have a good record of look after our frog boys. Right, if we got time for ward training. Send them. I know you. You've always wanted a place to call your own. Good morning. Somewhere that somehow mixes the cool of the city with the calm of the countryside. Welcome to Camouflage Falls. Coming soon to Two Point County. Random. Camouflage Falls. Definitely what we say it is. <laughs> Definitely what they say it is. This is Two Point Radio. <laughs> well, why would they lie, chat? Why would they lie? Okay. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. Probably going to end up in the minus again. Which is going to suck, but... Be alright. God, that, front, that upgrade cannot come soon enough. Peeps be dying. Lot of training going on here. Stop dancing on tables, idiots! You fall and break your neck. Then I'll laugh. Ha 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 ha. Fools. Yeah, we've got a while to the next wave. Take a break. Somehow made money. Interesting. Must have been some, like, big money patients. 50k. It's not bad size. 
hoping all those doctors are trained before the next wave. There's only three patients remaining. It's just kind of nerve wracking. Oh, that's nice. Let's give it snowbees. Well, the ward's done. That's good. I'm hoping the five doctor surgeries we have just just work. Everyone's just hanging out in the uh, staff rooms now. Cool, general practice is done too. Cure 10 patients with Frogborn. That has not been going well so far. If I'm uh, absolutely honest. Yeah, they come through here. I should make over here the reception. reception. But how would that work with... Setting up the GPs. I don't know. Maybe they're only heading this way because so if we set up that room as an admin, I don't know. Who is Steve the Sailor here? Dude, it's Scuba Steve. A report released today claims that Two Point County has the best medical coverage in the country. And while it does say it can't vote it's all right, it's fine, it's fine. Wellness centers, they're sure those are top we have doctors options. on the way back. That's good enough for me. It's alright, the, the having them like flash up at five and six is like alarmist, really. It's not too much of an issue. I am very, very nervous about the whole curing ten people with Rogborn. I don't see that happening. Also, I said yes to the fracture. I haven't got a fracture ward, and I don't have the money for a fracture ward. Who's complaining now? Ursula Wielder. Weren't you just complaining? Like, I'm sure you were literally just someone who said they were going. Right, uh, fracture ward. Why aren't I seeing it? There it is. Gonna pop on there for now. Now we'll probably end up moving. Should be alright. Unless it gets absolutely swamped. That should be fine. There we go. I do wonder if uh, the Scuba Steve-esque person might need a, a different kind of area as well. Kind of like, do I get this middle building over here? And <laughs> just have that as a reception. <laughs> it's a bit out of the way though. Up there wouldn't be a bad idea as a reception either. First person with frog born already dead. Lovely. We might have to do something like a frog born campaign combined with like a second level up of it. What's your. You only got one treatment. That's probably a lot of the issue. Honestly. I think we just get them to wait, and then that'll have to do. Uh, we've got two ward nurses, so they can go over there. It's not a problem. Yeah, the toads are going to have to wait. I don't think we're going to cure turn. I think it's going to be like the first wave we actually fail. 
which is a bit of a pain in the ass, but... We do what we can, as long as they survive for a little bit. Ba, 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 ba. We actually need seven people queuing for it. <laughs> Who's taken over? Who are you? This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. Would you believe it? Old Henry George We couldn't train you. That's annoying. Safety inspector is God damn it, really? Medi Dung Farm. Apparently the place is infested with cows, pigs and chickens. Oh, we are absolutely are not Henry. making this. We need I, th I think we need at least the upgrade and then a, a, a treatment two person working on it. Dead. Not not even like failed cure. Dead. Fucking dead. Jesus Christ. I mean we we have enough if we cure every person, but put down the infected. <laughs> we need to cure them, D. We need to cure them. Uh, it was a very frog heavy wave, which is a good, I guess. There's still a chance. Okay, at least that was uncured rather than dead. Training course complete. Class dismissed. No, I don't want her working in there. We've got to hope that she doesn't kill anybody, basically. The other alternative is that research gets done in time, but like I don't see it getting done anytime soon. We've got two minutes till the end of the stream. Very exciting times. Yeah. I do I do love how this machine works. You know, there's absolutely enough people for us to make this. It's just whether or not they all get treated or not. We're living that hope life. But yeah, there's more than enough people here to actually get it done. End of year approaching. In fact, we might even get the upgrade in, depending on how it goes. Send them. We can, do, we can do with the money. All fixed. Go! Cure them before they start dying. That's the other thing as well. We've got to make sure we cure them before they die, but let's see how we get on. <laughs> Look at these swimmy boys! God, this game is just so silly. Good, good, good. It's another cure. Big moves. How are you on that? You gonna take a while yet? Yeah, that's fine. I was looking at the time like, oh, shit, I've still got to like, eat, but like, I think food is pretty much already cooked. Just gotta get out of slow cooker. It's a great device. Dean, let me tell you, I've we've got uh, gammon in the slow cooker with carrots and potatoes soaking in apple sauce, uh, apple juice. Very nice. I do feel like I waste the juice a lot though, but I because I always use like a lot of it. <laughs> But it basically makes like pulled gammon rather than like sliced. It's really good. <laughs> so soft. So tasty. I need to start looking at ways to turn the juice into a sauce. Because far too much of it goes to waste. Unzips. <laughs> Me too. I unzip my trousers because I have to pop the button off because my belly's going to expand with all the gammon I'm about to eat. I think virtually everybody was like a frog boy, which is like working out quite well for us. Very big. And now the news. 
Ah. Dangerous animal has escaped from Crockle Bay. There's still nine, eight more people to cure. To reveal what so basically, we need a fifty percent hit rate from now on. Nine foot half tiger, half rhino, with a big appetite. We might half just get an upgrade in. Need to buy a ticket to see it. Which would be very helpful. Uh. Might as well get people in for that. Uses a bit of the money, but... I ah, see, this is the issue. We've got people that are starting to... Bleed out a little bit. So you need to be number one. I mean, a lot of them... A lot of them might not make it. Especially with this having to happen. I can't really afford to upgrade it. I get the feeling we're going to have at least two or three die in the queue. Which sucks, but... What can you do? Have something to eat. That always cures people in video games. <laughs> that was a dinner as in we didn't make it. That sucks. I get the feeling I'm, I'm going to have to redo this wave. We've got three more. Two more. I just want to know that I've cleared this and I'm going to call it a stream. <laughs> oh, the stress. The stress of running a hospital. They're literally pulling frogs out of the human bodies is what I'm like seeing here I think <laughs> okay that is Nishkut a lot of my yucks looking bad over here if someone could come over and water them and that nurse is going on break oh no Leila Chutney's back do we not have a better nurse? You want to break on call? You're on call. Yo, dude, I need you over here. I'm very aware Layla Chutney just killed somebody. Somebody killed my mama. But I can't risk it. Although, if she kills this person, we're good. She's done it! And she deserves a promotion with a big, fat pay rise. You love to see it. Never, ever will I ever again disparage the name Layla Chutney. A queen of the health industry. You will be getting uh, trained next episode. <laughs> and he fuck. You think you deserve a promotion when you didn't even cure that person? You are not getting much of a pay rise. Disgusting. Right, next wave will be for the next episode, then, boys and girls. Thank you very much for watching, as always. Uh, button press. I am going to be back at 7 p.m. with Call of Duty Warzone with uh, Murdo and Mecha, I believe. Team Jam Mam Mam is in full effect. Uh, for now, I'm Jester. Hello, I stream on twitch.tv forward slash Jestertainment. See my VODs, vlogs, and other videos at youtube.com forward slash Jester on demand. Holy shit. <laughs> I'll see <laughs> what I'm ranting about this week. Twitter.com forward slash Jestertainment underscore. To join our Discord, it is bit.ly slash Discord. If you want to support the channel, if you're watching and following, you're doing a great job, and thank you so much for doing so. If you want to do more than that, you can, of course, go to uh, Discord. Is it? No, not Discord. Uh, Patreon.com forward slash Jestertainment, just like my wonderful Patreon producers, who are Binglepin, who is available at twitch.tv, and Twitter.com as Binglepin. Murdo, who is available at twitch.tv forward slash Murdo, and Twitter.com forward slash Murdo, he wrote. And Jacklong Kawaii, who's available at Instagram.com as Jacklong Pastel Goth and Princess Music. That's right, that I is a V. Boys and girls, I'll be back at 7pm, but for now, have a great evening, and I shall see you in the next one. See ya! And... Pop up on later stream too. Thank you, Dean. <laughs>